Alex, the normies, we're back to watch the season two finale oh of God. BoJack Horseman, episode 12, Out to Sea. All right. <laughs> so it looks like he's continuing to run away because he was... I think he's just going to take that boat and run away further. Escape to L.A., but Not remember, uh, we, we were drinking a little bit in the Dude. last three. But if you guys remember L.A., he, he couldn't escape himself. So his boat is just like a parrot. doesn't even make any sense, the title now. And especially, he committed such a nasty thing on that. Nasty act uh, on that boat itself. That boat well, is juju yeah. now. Yeah, it's just like... I mean, almost committed, but might as well have, yeah. Might as well did. have. He, like, he was he going did. for nah, it. Nah, dude, he was going, they were going for it, bro. That's no, like, they, they, they were what happened? She, she came in, like, right before... What happened was, what happened was, seriously, a miracle, how she caught them, if anything. I mean, I, I mean obviously, it was written into it, but the way it happened was obviously a miracle. And he, they had full intention of what they were doing. So it was like a full circle because they. She, she, if anybody, if, yeah, her friend got. I mean, what's his, what's his friend's name again? Because they did that, like the light on the balloon things, and now he did it with her daughter. Like it's just full circle. What would yeah. you think about the? You know how we didn't actually get an intro. You remember we were like gonna take a shot during the intro. Yeah. And it was like it was like ooh the the family, and then uh it, he kind of did do the intro. In yeah, the at the end when yeah. he was like leaving, I thought that was really cool. Well yeah, done. It's yeah. Just, it was a, this, this, it was a clever way to just catch us up on uh, Charlotte. I feel like yeah. I feel like you guys described it the best. It was like Game of Thrones, like the se- like the season, like the, the second to last episode is always the one that goes wow. It was like that because I thought it was it was a season finale. Yeah, I, I was yeah, like it was. Yeah. It felt I was like pretty. wow, this is so good. <laughs> it was good. I'm fucking Diane. I like it. it was excellent. Diane <laughs> is still <laughs> there. She's been there for at least at least three months because Bojack was in New Mexico for two. Oh, yeah, he's with Diana. Do you think she? Do you think Bojack and Diana are gonna escape out to um, sea? I damn, I could kind of see because they're both trying yeah. to run away. Yeah, yeah they're right. And then in the season three, they come back and, to face everything. Uh, Press play. I want to see what's gonna happen with this movie now. Press play. Uh, I don't remember what happened. Yeah, with this like movie. is the movie still going on? Like it's just been on hold for two months. Um, let's find out. Many <laughs> let's find out. Do you, what do you guys uh, your predictions? Are resolution or just more misery? Misery. misery. I misery. Yeah, yeah. Misery loves yeah. company. I feel like I said, I said at the beginning show. of the season, I was like, he's gonna be happy for a bit, but this oh, will go downhill. Oh, and, and Todd is uh, stuck <clears throat> in an improv group. Yeah, man, he's in. A, he's stuck with that improv group, bro. He's stuck in our cult. So no, no, no. He can leave whenever he wants to. <laughs> Look alive, bright eyes. It's the morning, and somebody loves you. Right back at oh, what's that fucking alarm? <laughs> I love you, Mr. Peanut Butter. I love you too. Idea for a new Pixar movie. What are pizza boxes thinking about? <laughs> Stanford. Transcontinental Railroad. Transcontinental Railroad. That is correct. Next question. She's what watched. is my, oh my favorite God. kind of berry? Uh, so she's not doing anything truly terrible. She's just being like a bum. But still. I would love to be a bum like that. Diane, if you're watching this, I love you. And I know you're doing great things. <laughs> yeah, that's for a new app. An undo button that could undo long amounts of time. Three months, a year, a life. One click and everything could just go back to the way it was. Oh, yeah. Spot. You're still here? Yeah. Yep. <gasps> oh, still here. Right yep. Oh, damn. <clears throat> Wow. Are you ready for a shot, guys? I'm just kidding. <laughs> How'd you guys feel this morning? I was okay. I mean, I was not going to wake up for Love Handle, I realized. No, I was like, fuck, thanks. Yeah, but I was okay for like... I'm kind know. of sad about it. It was raining. If, they, if, they, ever ha- morning, if, if they ever have that soft shell crab again... I will never have that. You know what's so fucked up to today? They had like a DJ brunch set at the Love Handle. Really? Yeah, my yeah. friend, you know, Cat Miller, yeah. they had a whole DJ set up there. Oh, yeah. I know, I was like, but well, one day we don't go. <laughs> they had the new director in the background. They, they had yeah, Diane yeah. back in the kitchen, see? Yeah. In the rug or whatever? Mm-hmm. Yeah, this show... No, 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 this no. show has really, really good continuity jokes. I love Or it. just continuity in general. Including yeah. its yeah. running theme. Running gags. The running guy. <laughs> the guy is a running theme, literally. <laughs> <laughs> I need his workout plan. Wake up, Captain Dumb Shit. <laughs> trying to get in touch with you for two months. He crashed the ship? Oh. They finished the movie. What? How? Explain yourself, Landwench. I don't know. Ask oh, they have a CGI face. 
Remember at Herb's funeral, <coughs> I asked you what you wanted me to do with your horsing around residuals? Uh, you said, give it to an orphanage or something. What? Well, it turns out you made enough money to build a brand new one. Uh, so congratulations, you're a hero. Oh, what? Yeah. It's gonna be in his name. What? He did nothing in the... <laughs> You're a great man. Welcome to the BoJack Horseman Orphanage. Welcome to Berry If under rehearsed <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a good person. In fact, this is the only good thing I've ever done. And I did it by hand. <laughs> and it just goes to show you, life is just... What am I saying? No, to tell you how hard life is. You're the ones with the dead parents. My oh parents my. are dead? No, no, not necessarily. Maybe they just didn't want you. Oh, tell them Santa Claus isn't real. I don't understand. It's amazing to me that people wake up every morning and say, Yeah, another day. Let's do it. How do people do it? I don't know how. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so he just shaped the future of these children, huh? Copernicus, how do you always come up with these amazing butt jokes? When you're a level nine, as I am, you don't come up with butt jokes. You live truthfully in the moment, and the butt joke comes to you. And you lick your butt all the time. So wise. Spilling the steak everywhere. On my comedy cruise line, The Giggle Show. Oh, the Giggle Show. No, don't go on that. you? I shall not. I like it. This is my number two. And I don't mean that kind of number two. <laughs> what? How, How do you do that? <laughs> but jokes. I'm sorry I bailed in the middle of production. If there's anything I can do. Do what do? Movie's finished. Remember your first week these nerds made a computer scan of your head so we could finish the movie if something happened to you? Please don't call us nerds, sir. Well, something happened to you, so these nerds finished the movie. Look at this. Look at computer phone. <laughs> Computer Bojack had so much charisma and screen presence, we ended up going back and replacing you in every scene. That's fucking hilarious. Computer You is giving the performance of your career. When people see what you do in this movie, they are going to storm Daniel Day Lewis's house, slap him out into the street, and shoot him in the head. That's that how is good messed your performance up. Is. It's going to make Daniel Day Lewis look like shit. They're going to hate Daniel Day Lewis. <laughs> <laughs> What's with all the. Should be devastated. Kaput. Kapleski. Are you actually Jewish? Because I feel like some of these you're just making up. Look, we got a screening this weekend. Come see the movie. We'll smooze, we'll kibitz. JK Simmons. Shlemiel, Shlemazel. Just think, Carolyn, in one week all wow. this will be out. Damn. Is this a little too bougie, though? No, it can never be bougie enough. I'm just starting off, you know. <laughs> she put it under her name. Oh, is that her advantage? I'm such a mega way. You know, just in case we have some late night. <laughs> oh, they made out. Oh, can we just freeze in this moment for a second? I just want to remember this instant. This slick back dude is going to fuck you over, dude. Uh, my wife and I are going to the ballet tonight, and there's a real ish with the restaurant. This is the wife you're divorcing, right? Well, you know how it is. I am definitely going to divorce her, probably. It's just, ugh, it's hard to explain to someone who's never been married. Listen, this is... <laughs> oh, oh, sorry, sorry. Katie just said something funny. What? I got to hop. I love you, though. Uh, uh, you're such a slime ball. He's gonna fuck her over and it's gonna be well, I mean, we knew that, right? Okay. I mean, I'll take I mean, the company right underneath him, honestly. Now, I'll now, fuck now him it's over. like out there. I'm finally moving out, just like you wanted. Good. Honestly, you'll probably be better <sighs> off without me. Probably. I want you to come on board and write celebrity tweets. I don't know how to do that. You're a ghostwriter. Uh, it's the same uh, as writing a book. Yes. They're just a lot shorter and more people read them. All right. <laughs> I'm sure that actually because is a thing, too. Right Ghostwriting celebrity tweets. We've arrived at your living quarters. Wow. No more couch sleeping for this guy. He's got a bucket he as a bathroom. Up. Like, man, I'm thinking trying to talk you and treat it like shit, bro. Todd is optimistic. Guy. Yeah, he somehow found some no a thing worse than Bojack and it's Scientology. <laughs> I mean, improv comedy. Mr. Witherspoon's in the hospital. He had a stroke. Oh. Well, you know what you rat bastards can stroke? Uh, My big oh. hairy. <gasps> well, we burned that bridge. They probably could have took over that company. Yeah, we're staying in the, uh, yeah. uh, Princess Carolyn could have been... He refused to scrub the floors. Please, oh. my knees were cramping, so I needed to stand. Right. Don't worry. I'm going to go to Copernicus and get this sorted out. Copernicus? Uh, Huh? 
He's like, because he's a cat, he crawls through things. <laughs> 101 butt jokes? <laughs> Rear? Who? <laughs> <laughs> Copernicus is a fraud! A fraud? Me? Ow! Oh. <laughs> Man, you better get tired of this shit. Todd, you better. Shame on all of you! Just wait till you see my TripAdvisor review! This Bruce <laughs> is getting three stars because I am very mixed feelings about it. <laughs> <laughs> we love Todd. <laughs> Kiss me once, then kiss me twice. I don't want to do that anymore. Who I told you, that? we can make this work. No, I, I don't want- Carolyn, you're a single woman in your 40s. Can you really afford to be picky? Oh my <gasps> god. I'm just saying, what, you, you think you're gonna find some perfect, unattached guy who's gonna love you like I do? This is what you get, and if you're holding out for something better, well, I hate to break it to you, but you're gonna be alone for a long time. I'm not afraid of being alone, and you might want to find someplace else to work because you're not coming with me. I knew she'd fuck him over and said. My name is on all the paperwork. I think I can do it without you. Nice. Good luck. Whoa, 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 Carolyn, we just got... Carolyn! My name is Princess Carolyn. Yeah! yeah. That was good. I forgot about that. This <laughs> computer project. It looks just like him. Better. And this time, I was gonna win. The race of life. Old that was actually good. We're doing a full awards push. You should clear your schedule for the next yeah, year. But it wasn't Secretariat, and it wasn't me. It was a computer. What difference does it make? Smile and collect your trophies. You know Anna Spanakopita? Hello. Ah, they call her <laughs> the Oscar Whisper. Anna Spanakopita, forgot about her. I'm going to win you an Oscar. Anna is the best there is. You that was go. such a beautiful performance. So brave. Thank you. Everyone here loves you. Do you feel that? Babushka Cola. Our research yeah. shows America likes to think. They know the music right know. now. At a certain point, they pass a threshold where they actually know you, and then they find you weird and off-putting. Are you saying that nobody who really knows me could ever love me? No, 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 no. no. Not nobody. No. What am I <laughs> doing here? I don't know where you're going, but if you could run there. <laughs> Oh, he's going off. Can you check it out. Oh, oh. Toy Card! What the Elefante. hell? Elefante. Hi. Thanks for Sextina Aquafina, baby! He's Padre, Abercrombie, and Fitch. And. <laughs> <laughs> you don't remember that? No. <laughs> I don't remember this character at all. No. I gotta go get my blowhole, please. Oh! <laughs> Thank you so much. You people are the right. Oh, Nahid, you were right, bro. You predicted this. Oh! Hey, Diane. Hey. Uh, um. So. How's Cordovia? The, the batteries in the remote died. I think I'm just gonna take him out of the smoke detector. No, don't do that. Well, I'm out of options. Listen, I know this sounds crazy, but I think maybe you should get back here so you can help me find the batteries. Oh. Yeah. I know you're doing important work. And I think you should come home. Is that? Really, what you want? Of course it is. I I'm looking at this website right now. It says if I leave immediately, I can still make it home tonight. That sounds great. I love you. I love you too, Diane. You know, it's the funniest thing. There is a woman in this restaurant who looks just like you. <laughs> Come on, bro. You just played this whole thing. I <laughs> think he's just fucking around. Okay, it's Mr. Peanut Butter. You can never know. Either one more suggestion. He's a level two now. He was level eight, now he's level two. No, he was level one before, right? He was level eight. Todd was level eight. Was level eight. Uh, your name is Todd. You're 24, you live on my couch, and you've always seen the good in me. Aww. Belong back home. So if you're any kind of improviser, you'll take that suggestion and you'll run with it. Huh. Run. <laughs> I'm afraid that getting out of here is not an option. Well, what the hell are you gonna do about it? Stop you with these. <laughs> oh no! Don't do anything crazy, guys. <laughs> can't feel the wrath of my flamethrower. <laughs> Too bad we're wearing sunscreen with SPF a million. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs>
Scenarios I know. Right now. Uh, Bojack. <laughs> There's literally nothing happening to you. <laughs> you don't understand. If you die in an improv, <laughs> you die. <laughs> Fine. I guess I have a guard killing machine. <gasps> no! I have a wife and children. <laughs> well, they're improvised, but they're real to me. Can <laughs> <laughs> oh, this be the end? <laughs> this whole ship is full of idiots. Beep, <laughs> <laughs> that was awesome. Oh. Escape from LA. Improv is fun and great and everything, but you guys are really into it. <laughs> I'm gonna go with my <laughs> <laughs> I thought this was the man who sabotaged your rock opera. Is this your friend, Todd? We're your friends, Todd. Uh, I, uh... Hash browns! The first morning you stayed with me, you, you kept making them and I kept eating them. And then I threw up in the pool, and that made you throw up in the pool, and then I got mad at you for throwing up in my pool, but you said, thank you for letting me stay here. I, I don't have anywhere else to go. And I remember when you said that, because I felt good about myself, and I, I don't feel that way a lot. Letting you stay with me was the best thing I ever did on purpose, and I don't think I ever told you that, but I should have, because you're my best friend. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, if you just made all that up, that was some really good. <laughs> I keep getting calls from this New York playwright. She really wants to talk to you. She says you know her, Jill Pill. Jill Pill. Apparently she worked on your TV show. Worse than a rap? No, actually. The other TV show. Other TV show? Oh, shit. What is happening? Oh, yeah. I really don't know what to do with this thing. Do you want it? Yeah. Why did I take you with me? <laughs> oh my god. Herb loved orphans. Oh nice. Mostly as a delivery apparatus. For oh, another good thing to do on purpose. Do you guys see his, um, what do we call that bass thing he matches his outfit? Why does it say Jerb Kazaz? Your email said Jerb. <laughs> <laughs> kind of sounds like something you'd get out of Mediterranean room. <laughs> you want me to box up this Jerb Kazaz for you? And you say... <laughs> No. <laughs> <laughs> the Jerb Kazaz. No. I kind of want a Jerb Kazaz. Who would probably think that this is pretty funny that you couldn't even get this right? Yeah, he would. It's yeah. perfect. Want to get some Mediterranean food? You read my mind. <laughs> Running is terrible. Everything is the worst. <laughs> he did it. I've never seen him there. He got up. It gets easier. That's the guy! But you gotta do it every day. That's the hard part. But it does get easier. Uh, uh. <sighs> okay. Yeah, Lance Bass! I love Lance Bass! Who was he in this? Who was Lance Bass? Lance you Bass was... From Bass know, from in that, I mean, in that episode, who was Lance Bass? I'm looking up right now. Oh, uh, that was a... Uh, guys think? Huh. It ended on a, I think like Game of Thrones, it kind of previewed the next season. Ended on a lighter note. Kind it of, did yeah, not turn out to be a disaster like we predicted. But, I mean, what happened still happened. And, like, Bojack still feels fucked up about it. But, like, what do we see? We see him get immediately rewarded. <laughs> he played Lance Bass. He played a bass, bro. Lance Bass played the bass. Where was the... Which bass? I'll show you. Go back, bro. I saw it. Yeah, oh, yeah. he was the director? Yeah, bro. Uh, he was the bass, bro. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Not, no, no. He was this bass. He was the bass on the the Mr. Peanut Butter show that uh, oh. Diane was watching. He was Lance oh, Bass, bro. So, uh, <laughs> yeah, guys. What do you... So, What'd you think of the running... The, the running theme had a nice little... I love the running theme. I, Man, it gets easier. I just feel like all oh, this is gonna come back and bite him in the butt, bro. What? Just the actions he did. At what? Because he didn't want to mention how he why he bought the boat. He didn't want to mention it to. Oh him. yeah, he, he was, was like, I don't Charlotte. remember. I don't yeah, remember. bro. I think all of it's gonna still come back to him. I feel like. I don't know, man. I I just feel like he's gonna get famous. Animal up there. Like we've always heard of despicable and shitty things Bojack has done in the past. Through, yeah. Like, Todd stories and stuff, but then like, I think we like finally just like saw him just play out one of his shittiest acts. And like, uh, yeah, who did he say it to? I don't know, to Princess Todd. Carolyn? Yeah. Todd. Todd. How Todd. did he say it? Was he just like, I don't Todd know. was we like, why do you have a boat? And Bojack was like, I don't remember. I remember where I got it. So like, 
and anytime he's ever said that in the past for anything, he's probably had a situation like that happen and he's mm. trying to cover it up. But this is this one is probably the worst thing he's probably done. I think. I mean, it was fucked up. It was fucked it's up. just about the worst thing you can do. Um, in this episode, though, I really enjoy how Miss Princess Caroline came to terms to you know she didn't need the rabbit guy and she was happy on her own and yada 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 and then. How Mr. Bojack came to terms with like Todd and like mending his friendship, like everything was mending. Saving Todd was great. Yeah, saving Todd was the best thing ever. The whole like yeah. um, improv scene and Bojack watching it, he probably was like, "The fuck is this?" <laughs> you yeah, had it nice on all the time. Wow, <laughs> it was but, good. But I like how they came in full circles and everything was like resolved instead of everything going to freaking shit. Mr. Mr. Peanut Butter and Diane resolving their stuff too, like everyone I, resolved I their issues. I did not like that. I was gonna say, how I didn't you think like about that. that? At all. I didn't like that at all. I didn't. That was. It was cute. I, no, I would Mr. not. Mr. Peanut Butter loved if her so much. If your much. significant other like did that to you, lied to you for for three plus months, mm-hmm. and then you just saw them having dinner, like, nah, man. I feel like I'm there sorry. will be re- repercussions about it. Like, there, there will. Be, I hope there I are. I think the thing is like, is he yeah, like, I think I, I, what you're like, upset about. I think the finale was dog. maybe missing a scene, like. I think, I think in order all... to preview next season, they should have shown, like, but like a it, conversation happen. But, but again, his personality is the dog, so he's just, like, yeah. excited to see her again. But, like, yeah. but the human, I don't know. I didn't like that at all. I, I agree with you, Mickey. I didn't yeah. like that at all. I mean, it, for me, like, Mr. Bojack, sorry, Mr. Peanut Butter is a dog, and he was so happy to see Diane back, and he loves her so much. I feel like because he's so in touch with her feelings too, as an animal, you know, he's like, okay, I think this is what I need to do. Like, she's hurting. He felt her hurting, yeah. so he like made it easier for her. Yeah, that's what I think at least. I know, but like they I usually, think, I mean, obviously a conversation needs to be had. So yeah, like, yeah. You know, I, I hope there but are. But he just made it easier for her to come back because he knew was, he knew like, okay, in order for us to even have this conversation, she's gonna need to be comfortable. Yeah, yeah. And, like he can, he's willing to go to do that because he is. Like, she was like too I feel like maybe stubborn or prideful to come back so that's why she let all that time pass but like I know she regretted it and like she just didn't know how to go back to him so him doing that really had a relief for her too you could tell she's like thinking like thank god like, that this is, is my way back in that just means that he's like a really good dude Mr. Peanut Butter like I, I, I would like he's got a very I'm leaving you for three months I'll be back later he's got his head on his okay, shoulders like, like that butter. I ain't like that. Mr. Peanut Butter is, is a good guy. He's yeah. a yeah. He's, he's, he's a good guy. He's, he's always been the bigger man in every yeah. situation. Yeah, always, seen always. Him, but she missed him. Like you saw, she was repeat. She knew all the answers to like the show. She mm-hmm. was watching him. She was like, she just needed to find her way back in. I just, yeah, yeah, like I said, she wasn't doing anything like terrible. Yeah, like it was just like. But still, uh, yeah. I just I'm running away. Still. She was just running away from her responsibilities. Still. You know? Yeah, I mean, running away from her. Marriage. She didn't do no Bojack shit. It's mm-hmm. a it's a big yeah. I mean, and she didn't do that, but it's like. I don't know. Yeah, you know, she she was just hiding for like three months. It's what's, a really big lie. What's your opinion on Bojack being an Oscar contender and this movie being movie of the year and it's all so the CGI? Funny. I wonder. Like, is that how would you feel if you were Bojack? This is your dream movie, and, and it's good, but this completely really changed, shitty, and then they, they replace no. you with a pussy. Yeah, if I was grimy like wasn't Bojack, even you. if I was grimy like Bojack, I'd roll with it and like get as much as I can out Next of it. Next season's great, guys. This is. The, like the Game of Thrones thing is something people say a lot, but in terms of episode structure, this show definitely follows that. Like yeah. the episode before, big shit goes down. We still we still saw some resolution, but I think no. proper setup. Get ready to. It's been good. See Anna Spanakopita more often. It's been good. Cool. The the guy jogging, I can't believe we saw him. Like I didn't think we were gonna hear his voice. Like we just been calling him out all, like all the episodes. That was a great. I, I, love I his, hope like, they maybe it's the, it, the hard part. You got to do it every day. That's the hard part. And, and the thing is, I I, I hope easier. I hope they maybe explore his character a little bit because like obviously he lives next to Bojack. He knows who Bojack is. He knows the type of person he is. So maybe he's like speaking. Maybe maybe he did some. Maybe, shitty, Bojack's yeah. inventor. maybe he did some shitty things in his life and he's speaking I'm, from experience. I'm not gonna lie. It's been getting better as it's been going. So I'm. Very excited yeah. for next season. Oh man, next season is oh bro, you all don't even know. Yeah, wait, Overall, I think season two so far is my favorite season. I mean, better season, two, season yeah, so far. I loved it. I think it. you're I gonna it. say that for three and then four. Okay, because this that's was why a I'm great, excited for five. Yeah, this was a great season, you guys. I mean, they. I, and I we didn't still have the Christmas special and the horse yeah. and run. I'm not gonna lie, dudes. When we first started season one, I was not that into it. I'm, I love it now. 
Yeah, you cute. start to see how human these characters are. Yeah, I have to. I, I, I humanize them more. That's definitely. God, what are they doing up there? It's just, <laughs> just like three of causing them. a ruckus. All right, guys. Well, All right, guys. Check out our early access options if you want to see next season right now. You can. Season Holy three geez. episode. You what? can do that right now. Holy hell! <laughs> on Patreon. Oh yeah. Links are in the description. Check it out. See you next time. Love Bye. you. Bye. Thanks for joining us for the season two finale of BoJack Horseman. What a season this was. We're super excited for season three. Shout out to our super patrons listed in yellow. Thank you for your continued support. Thanks to all our fans for your continued support. Check out our Patreon for uncut early access content. Check out the video description for important links. And we'll see you guys for season three.